Hi, I'm Peter Kalmström of Kalmström.com Business Solutions. In this demonstration, I'll continue my series on editing pages to insert images. I'm going to go into edit mode on the page, and then I'll go into the insert page here. And as you've seen before, there are three options here from computer, from address, which I've shown before. And I also want to show from SharePoint. This is kind of a misnomer because it's not all of SharePoint. It is the site collection that you are, current location. If you have another site collection, you can insert the image by just typing in the image there. But in most cases, I find it easier to insert from address. But you can do this and you can insert an image like this, like site pages, home, and there's an image right there called a bubble, and you can insert that. That works just fine. So that's a third way of adding images to your page. Final thing that I want to show you on images is that you can, of course, insert links into these images. And that's very, very common on the internet that when you have a link, you might want an image. When you have an image, you might want to link that to a larger version of that image or something like that. In this case, I'm just going to add a link from the image to the calmstrom.com to www.calmstrom.com. You do need to insert the whole link like that. So that of course makes this image clickable now. So if I save that page, and as you'll notice now when I hover over, I get the little pointer icon there and by clicking the image, I get that opening in the same window. However, I might not want that. I'm gonna show you how to open that in a new window. So when you have an image that's hyperlinked, when you select that image, you'll notice that I get both the image tab and the link tab. And there I can select open in new tab. Let's try that and just save the page again. And now when I click, I should get a new tab. And yes, I do. So that concludes this demo on how to insert an image from SharePoint and I also added the adding a link to an image there. Thank you for watching this demonstration.